Hey guys, super important thing we don't talk about very often, going on dates. Yeah, if you're single right now, there's nothing wrong with that. But if you wanna find your ideal partner and get the relationship you really want, well then you need to go on some dates. Basically, you gotta go on dates, yeah? If you wanna find gold, you can't find gold without digging. You gotta go on dates, all right? So, what do you do? If you haven't been on a date in a year or a few months, and it's been a while since you've been on a date, you need to go on some dates, okay? Now, I was talking to one of my clients, she hasn't been on a date in about three months. Now, what's the chance of her finding her ideal partner? Well, zero, she's not going on any dates. You have to go on dates, okay? Now, what I recommend, ideally, if you're really serious about finding your ideal partner, try to go on a date, you know, at least one date a week with somebody new. Or if you find someone you like, then keep going on dates with them at least once a week. You should be going on a date at least once a week anyway, regardless of where you are. So, online dating. You wanna find your ideal partner, you go on online dating, great. Now, online dating is absolutely fantastic. Get it in your head that it's absolutely fantastic. If you say lots of negative things to yourself all the time about online dating, you're gonna believe it and you're gonna have negative results. Tell yourself positive things. Online dating is great. I love online dating. I'm gonna find my ideal partner on here. Give yourself some positive reassurance and say positive things about the experience. It's not all bad, okay? Okay, so you're talking to a guy on there, okay? Try to build a, a little bit of rapport and then he should wanna see you, okay? Or you can prompt the conversation that way so if the, so if the conversation goes on for a while but he's not asking you on a date directly, you say to him, Okay, so when are you gonna take me on a date? Yeah? Now, ideally, the guy asks you out and you don't have to prompt him, but if you have to prompt him, it's okay. You gotta get on that first date to see what it's like in person. A very common mistake a lot of people make, they, they make the conversation go way too long on online dating. Don't talk to them longer than a week, okay? Talk to them for a little bit, build a little, a little bit of rapport, and then go on a date together. Plan the date, execute the date effectively. Go on a good, positive date together. Okay, online dating is not for pen pals. It's for going on dates. Go on dates together. Not Don't be pen pals and talk every day, but never eventuate. Another thing which a lot of people find very successful is they meet someone online dating and then they get off the app straight away. Okay, so you meet someone online dating and then say, great, you know what, Let's. how about we talk on Instagram or how about we talk on Facebook or can I have your number? Yeah. So get off the app quickly. It's gonna make the experience more positive, okay? I hope that, I hope that makes sense. You gotta go on dates. You have to go on dates. The same as if you want a really good body, you have to eat healthy and you gotta exercise. There's no secrets to it, guys. There's no secret tricks, okay? There's ways to do it smart and there's definitely ways to do it stupid, but at the end of the day, you still gotta exercise. It's the same with dating. Now you can be really bad at dating and go on dates with the wrong people and you're not gonna get anywhere, correct. But regardless, you still have to go on dates. Whether you do it right or you do it wrong, that's something to learn and that's something I definitely can teach you and help a lot of people with, but you still have to go on dates. Go on dates regularly, talk to people, get dates organized, get them planned. They can be a lot of fun. They can be a lot of fun. And don't live your life in fear. A lot of people live their life in fear. It's a huge mistake. Okay, if you're a female, let a guy pick you up, take you on a date effectively, let him plan it, let him make the whole date a surprise. If you're so stricken with fear and anxiety that you don't want someone picking you up and you don't like doing things by yourself and all this sort of stuff, you're never gonna find your ideal partner anyway. You have far too much of a fear-based mindset and you're too stricken with anxiety to even put on your shoes and do anything. So don't waste your time, okay? If you have a little bit of courage and you're a decent human being, let the man plan everything. Let him be the leader and then go on the date and have a good time, okay? People aren't out there to murder you. They're out there to have a good time as well, all right? So talk a little bit. Make sure the man's not a psycho and then say, you can pick me up at this time. Let's have a good time. And he picks you up. He takes you out. You have a good time. He drops you back off. And that's it. That's the end of the date and you have a great time, yeah? So that's you got to go on dates. Give love a chance to blossom, guys. Give love a chance. If you're not going on dates... You're never gonna be good at dates, okay? If you never go on a date and you go on it like one date a year, you're gonna be absolutely terrible at dating, okay? It's the same if you only play table tennis or ping pong once a year. How good are you gonna be? Not very good. You're not gonna be a pro, that's for sure. If you wanna be really good at dating, you gotta have the experience. You gotta practice. Practice makes perfect. Go on dates once a week. Even if you're married, go on dates once a week so you're really good at dating, okay? Dating and courtship never ends. 
all right? So keep that in mind. Keep that in mind, go on dates regularly so you get good at it and you can be a, ex, you can be a real expert Casanova, all right? Be romantic, have a good time, be physical, be funny, be flirty, be affectionate, be romantic. It's fun. It's fun to do those things. And I assume if you're watching this video, you also have a soft, you also have a soft spot for romance just like I have, which is fantastic. Enjoy it, guys. Enjoy it. Get out there. Go on a date this week. Regardless if you're single or in a relationship, go on a date this week. Make it happen. Let love blossom.